Oh, good evening. Oh, welcome to the programming dot blogspot dot com. Uh, today, I will show you a virtual classroom project in ESP dot net. So let's do open Visual Studio and click, or you can say the open that project in the solution. Now, uh, in this project. I have already set the start page of the virtual so now click to Google Chrome in which you can display your project this project is built in Visual Studio 2010 and the migrated and upgraded in Visual Studio 2013 so let's to start virtual classes yeah now again refresh it <coughs> yeah this is the demo of the virtual classes uh, speakers say something about uh, some technical programming languages so now first of all to log in into the students in the register panel this is the first phase of this project please fill the registration form before login write the name of the username check payment via check it's not facility is provided using paypal or the debit and credit card so first of all fill the username i have jacob password is also jacob and the email is jacob at the rate of gmail.com confirm email is same with the email jacob at the rate of gmail.com now address is from usa okay and the mobile number is randomly uh, put into the text box of the mobile number so one two three four five six seven eight and one zero now so select branch in which you to read some topics from the tutors so now click to register button and this is the single message after payment receive you can log in into your account after payment uh, so before payment you cannot log in to the your panel so click to admin login button admin check the user payment it's received or not via the check if check is received by the um, admin then admin change student information click to student information uh, there are six student username is Jacob and password is Jacob no pay so edit it if check is received and take by the admin so change the no pay text with the payment payment after receiving the payment and update the student information the students can log in into your R panels. So click to student and put the emails jacob at the rate of cmail.com. Password is also jacob. Select branch that is computer science and select year, second year. Now click to login button. Yeah. After uh, logging into your account, you can select tutorial subjects which is given by uh, tutors. Subject code is CS31, computer science 31 code, in which two files is existing mm, and uploaded by the tutors. CS31 download PPT. You can download their PPT. Yeah, PPT is downloaded here. And download the video files. That is the video file you can download here using IDM and other softwares or if you do not install the VLC other player you download it now 
after viewing the video and PPT you can ask something about uh, your uh, subjects from the tutor so I have a query and I want to uh, put the query to the uh, number one IT tutor which uh, their name is Rahul so I want to know about the label control and their users now submit to the select tutor ID is one okay log out that is the student panel log into tutor panel it's not admin so check the tutor by the admin login add new tutor allot select subjects to tutor that is the one is allotted by the uh, to the Rahul okay so log out I have already uh, tutor is only assigned by the admin so mm, put the Rahul's mail and password is also Rahul email is Rahul at the rate of gmail.com ok now login to tutor tutor login yeah login into the tutor account so uh, enter data to allotted subject ask questions that is ask question is I want to know about the label control I give answer via the mail system to the students who is raised the query okay that is a jacob at the rate of gmail.com so tutor put the uh, mail id into the email text box and give answer via the editor controls so give you give your answer here and click to submit button if your internet is connected then easily send to the now upload their content here enter video files if they are exist enter ppt file if they are exist the subject code is cs31 and add into your account okay now I'll click to admin again <coughs> allot subject to tutor uh, cs31 and cs33 is already uh, assigned to tutor 1 so now I want to uh, also assign some other subjects of the branch third year and also second year there is six subject is the yeah, subject code is already assigned to one tutor already assigned and cs32 is already assigned to other tutors yeah subject successfully allotted to the tutor rahul i have already uh, i have to add a new tutor in the this tutor login Rahul at the rate of com enter data to allotted subject subject code here yeah it33 is newly added okay so thank you thank you very much for watching this video tutorial oops and the virtual classroom project if you want to mm, if you want to buy or download the source code of the project please mail to narinkumar851 at the rate of gmail.com this is my mail id